Yo, hello and welcome back. This is Frost Hair, and we are playing MLB The Show against the Dodgers. It is the rubber match. We're on the road. Ooh, rain! It's Jordan Montgomery, who quite honestly had a very terrible game last night. Um, only went like three innings, just completely imploded. Uh, let's go Garrett Hampson up in here. It's a righty. So Gritchick hasn't played in a few days either. I might just have to get him in um, for like Lourdes and then just move him down the lineup. in. I think that's probably fine. There we go. Let's try this. And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. It's the Arizona Diamondbacks taking on the law. All right. This is Corbin Carroll. Oof. I have the day off today because I um, went to the Diamondbacks game just against the Dodgers just last night. Right and there, uh, just missed off didn't go well. The Diamondbacks got destroyed. In the air, left field. Um, Hernandez makes the grab. Didn't one get down. home until like one in the morning. So Here's Garrett I Hampson. had already assumed that it was going to get home around that time. Um, just on driving and stuff. Swings through that. Cold so, night tonight. Uh, one ball. That's a pretty uh, firm fastball right there. I tell you what, memories of getting jammed, they creeping into my mind right now. Got it by oh. <laughs> So yeah, Lots just uh, I'm sure he wants back at the plate. Two no, strikes, awesome. oh, yeah, sort of pitcher home looking run for a bit of a mistake, and I'd say in a very hittable location. But clearly the break was enough to get him to swing through so, it. Uh, Two out, space is empty. Um, yeah, ball. that skips in the dirt. Just three off. I plan on playing a lot of games today, but then my wife had some stuff going on and. So I here as he fouls uh, it away. hung out with my daughter this morning. We did some stuff. Uh, Two down, my wife did on. her stuff, and then now Best. she's finally giving me a little bit of time Slings to the first, and that's do some the third recordings out. for you all. Ready I'm still very the tired, man. The I'm exhausted. And now the DH, James Outman. I didn't get to see Alvin. I didn't get to see Otani. Well, don't expect too many more high fastballs. This is a good sinker ball pitcher, and sometimes they can make mistakes trying to oh, pitch up in the zone. Look for him to stay down around the knees to be effective. Got him swinging for the strikeout. He's out, man. To the heater. And now it's Gavin Lux. The punch out there, and two quick outs in the bottom of the first here tonight. Well, anytime you can punch out the top two guys in a lineup to start an inning, got to be feeling pretty good out there on the mound because when you think of just having a distraction, table setters on the base paths, and all of a sudden, well, plays made there, and that retires the side. Good, 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 good. Back here at Chavez Ravine, leading Chuck off Jock Peterson. Peterson. Glass now, ready deals. Pulled hard, but it's a foul yeah. ball. That sucks. You can keep it inside, probably. Now he breaks his bat. And he's safe hey. at first. Did a nice job getting there. Good throw, but very difficult to get anybody on that one as far as you had to go and throw. You know? Yeah, no question. And here is Geraldo Perdomo. There's one on to Freddy. Double play. Very composed play from the shortstop position right there. And that was a perfect decision. Go ahead, take it yourself, get to second, and then fire to first. Make sure you get those two outs. Two outs. Up the middle. Bats up with it. Fires over to first. That's the third out. Damn. Well, and welcome back to the ballpark. Mookie Betts will get us started. One of those games. 
I probably should play two games today instead of playing this and uh, some New York Overlord, but I don't know. <laughs> Here's Max Muncy, that funky Muncy. The 1-1 one, one is fouled off. Nothing, nothing here in the bottom of the second. A little bit high. It's two and two. It's a good take. Let's see here. Drive fastball. One down, base is empty. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. And there's two away. Off to a strong start. Man, I wish he'd have pitched like this last night. Out three of the first five he's faced. Well, he's definitely minimizing contact. He can get the swing and miss when he needs it, but I don't know what. Like so, I I have a mild concern with as well. what happened last night. Like, so Montgomery got scratched on Tuesday because of the bees. Got scratched on Tuesday because of the beast. Well, the pitch. he already warmed up and everything, and so they just the moved him back to two. last night. But Gallon was scheduled to pitch last night, so why not oh. steps on the bag, three up, just three skip down. Montgomery and be like, oh yeah, you pitched. Randall Sorry, pit, you know, throw a simulated game or whatever so that he doesn't, you know. Swing and a miss, and that one missed by a ton. It feels like we might be headed towards a rain delay if the weather doesn't ease up, Chris. Yeah, the umpire and crew are going to pay attention to how the weather is impacting this game. And the moment it Comes dangerous, I think, is the moment we'll be forced to take a break. Here's a one two. Ground ball up the middle. Luck. Oh. Gathers and throws to first. Leadoff hitter gone in the third. Alec Thomas now. One down, base is empty. One. And that one upstairs. Wouldn't chase Ball, that time. Nine. Swings through that Oof. one for strike two. That was ball three, ball four, two. Swing and a ball hit out towards left center field, and that'll fall for a base hit. But we don't think that pitch would have been called a strike, but. He did such a nice job of pulling his hands tight to the body and just getting enough of the barrel on it to be hard enough. Runner on the goal. And there's a foul ball. And here it comes. That's down and in. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Top of the third, no score. Runner goes again. Still two and two after the foul ball. Every time, man. Runner on the move again. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Right hander kicks deals. Runner goes again. Lux gets under it. Hauls it in for the out. Two down. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. Damn, it now, is here is Corbin Carroll. The 1-1. One -one. Rudder takes off. Swing and a miss. One ball. Safe at second with a stolen base. You know what? I like the aggressiveness right there. It looks like it's going to be tough to score in this one. Really good pitching so far. So why not try to put some pressure on them and see if you can steal the bat? The high heat. Too much on that one. Jesus Christ, that was awful.
back here in L.A. Bottom of the inning. And now Teoscar Hernandez out to short. Hampson throws across the diamond. One gone, bottom of the third inning. Here's Jason Hayward. I wonder if they have any, like, rain-specific things, like where you and bobble the ball or something. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Throw, and it gets away. There's Taylor down. The 2-2 two -two on the way. Ground ball could be two. There's one. That's an out. Double play. Yeah. What a twin. Oh, that looked close. Out of the fourth. Of the super two close. Garrett Hampson. The pitch. Hit hard. Should be extra bases. There we go. Around first, heading for two. And he's there with a lead-off double. Couldn't have timed it up any better than that. Great hands on that swing. Took the barrel right to the baseball. Caught it out front and lifted it into the gap. At that point, there's probably no question in his mind that he was going for two. That's just a... Oh, that ball finds its way to the outfield. A base hit. Oh, 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 Not nice. He's safe. And it's one nothing. Picks himself up in RBI. Got the top of the ball a little bit, but not much. That was hit pretty hard through the infield, so I think he'll be happy with that swing. Definitely generated some good bat speed. Swing and a miss. Chased it out of the zone. Inside, maybe? And another ball. Oh, he's really working him away, this at bat. Sometimes take a little bit off velocity. Try to get a rollover, something on the ground. Stay away from that big hole on the right side of the infield. Hey. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Gross. Another strikeout for Glass now. Geraldo Perdomo stands in now for the Diamondbacks. Two ball. Pitch out, but no action. <coughs> Walker leads off stealing? first with one away. Okay, I'll steal. Runner takes off. Fall off foul. Good job to fight that one off. Here's a 2-2. Runner goes again. Puts it in the air out towards left center. He's got it. And there's two away. Lane. Hey, Eugenio Suarez up to the plate now. Hey, Eugenio Suarez. And a punch three. out, but no steal. Man, and we're in two. his head. One we run are in his the head. So far, here in the third and final game of the series. Runner on the go. High fly ball out into left center field. Hayward under it. I guess let's keep running. And that'll do it. But the RBI single pushes across a run. And the home team. Back here at Dodger Stadium. Bottom four. Now here is James Outman. Jameson Outman. And it's two and one. Right through there for a strike. Swings here and blasts Oof. one left field. And that should be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. Well, that was one of those high percentage of trim my nails later. Batting averages are just so much higher. Really good swing right there. He got a pitch that he knew he could handle. Allowed himself to get back Lux just a tad this. bit longer. And he hit the ball on the screws. Left hand batter waits. Bounce to the right side. And it's through for a hit. Here comes the runner. Fires to the plate. The tag, and he's safe. Oh, he was out. Oh, he dropped the ball. Pretty <laughs> emotional, Dill. Sometimes those can find a hole and get you enough. And now let's see if they force some action with good wheels on the bases. Now a high fly ball Perdomo out to the left side. should have dove. And there's one down. <laughs> Now batting, second baseman. Here's Mookie now. All tied up here in the rubber match of this three-game series. 
Well, you always have to be careful in these spots because Mookie is lethal in the leadoff spot. He has the most multi-home run games out of the leadoff spot in baseball history. And now yeah, but he's not, a, he's not batting leadoff today. Two outs. Just missed. Back up the, oh, that got him. To first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. The batter now will be Will Smith. Montgomery. Next offering is in for a strike. He's pitching well, but not throwing a ton of first pitch strikes. Usually doesn't work out for success, but he can never predict baseball. That ball is foul, and the pressure is building. And that's off the inside edge. Two balls, two strikes. And that just Oh, where did that miss? And he deals. Stays alive. That is unbelievable. Two on, two outs. And he walked it. It wasn't easy, but he earned that walk after a long at bat. Here's Teoscar Hernandez. Well, that's a nice job of grinding out that at bat. Saw a lot of pitches and ends up drawing the walk. Very gritty. Hit in the air, right field. Carroll moving under it. Brings it in. And that ends the inning. But they pick Jesus. up one run on the RBI single. All even at one apiece. Back here at Chavez Ravine. All set for the start of the inning. Now the left fielder, Randall Gritchick. Line drive, and that there should be go. extra bases. Got some good Makes speed the turn and here. heads for second. And he's got a leadoff double. Well, a swing Take like it. that can help you come out of the struggle. We saw the numbers coming into the ball game, but all he's trying to do at this point is help his team win. Betts tosses to first, one away here in the fifth. I don't know why he went back to the bag. It's still going Francisco to third base. Okay. coming up to hit. Gritchick. The runner at second with one away. Last time. Next pitch, not close, up high. This one in the air. Makes the grab, two down. Good hard Sorry, fastball guys. up in the zone right there. They look Nails really, really good coming me. in, but so hard to get on top of as a hitter. So the batting order turns over. Corbin Carroll stands in now for the Diamondbacks. Could be extra bases. Heading for the plate. He will score, and the Diamondbacks take the lead. It's two to one. Bro cut off to third. He's in there. Well, there you go. The RBI machine. Another clutch run scoring at bat. Triple. Yeah, he's been so good in these situations. Call it clutch if you want. But his oh, we're going to give him that himself. pitch, but you wouldn't give me the pitch. The, she sucks. Kicks and deals. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. That ends the inning and stops things from getting out of hand. Arizona hits the board on this RBI. And welcome back to the ballpark. John Chami with my buddy Chris Singleton. It's set to get us started. Bottom five. Jason Hayden. Swing and a miss. He was late. Strike two. Well, on paper, it's favorable to have a fairly quick inning here with two of the three hitters he's set to face batting from the left side. Same side he throws from. Lifted in the air right center field. Carroll moving under it. And there's one away. And at the plate for the Dodgers, Chris Taylor. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. That is strike two. in front of that. Fights it off. You'll see another. Hey, those fans up there got some action. Just got Faces empty there. one away. Last half of inning number five. Oh, he gloves it to his knee. The throw, it's there, and that's a great play. Beautiful. Look at how he dives right there. He's able to pop up to both knees. Not enough time to get to his feet, but he threw a cannon across the diamond to get the runner. Two down, nobody on. Swings and misses. 
And a nice inning of work there as he sets it. Uh, gets Top a little warmed up here. And now it's Christian the Walker. The pitch. Hey. Got one and two. Man, oh. I mean, nice job just presenting it to be better than it actually was. Junk pitch. And the right hander deals. Swings and misses. It's a strikeout. Some high cheese for strike three. High heat, man. Don't and know now why. Jack Peterson. One out, base is empty. So a foul ball makes it Oops, one and two. Still batting pretty good, I think, this year. Righty to the plate. And that one almost hit him. Straighten him up a little bit. Almost 100 pitches through five and a third innings. I'm thinking he's probably done in the next couple of batters. One down, base is empty. And they'll do it again. Yep. I knew it was down there. Flew open a little bit with that front shoulder, but was able to slow his bat down just enough to make contact with that pitch. Keep the bat alive. Got him swinging. Two down, nobody on. And we're at the top half of the six. <laughs> this one in the air. <laughs> Muncie makes the grab, and that's the inning. Three up, three down. Bottom of the sixth inning, and the batter will be the shortstop, Gavin uh, Let's see. Let's get Barnes up, I guess. The pitch. Swing at a ball lifted to center field, and that will fall. Off to a good start with a leadoff down. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Nice swing to drive that pitch up the middle. Could have easily bit out in front on the off speed and pulled off of it, but... He was looking to use the big part of the field, and he executed his plan perfectly. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Foul ball, another 2-2 upcoming. <coughs> ball set to throw pitch number 100. He needs a quick inning here if he's going to be able to make it through six complete. Suarez over to Perdomo. That's one to first. Double play. Nicely done. Here's Mookie to hit. As a former player, watching 5-4-3 double plays brings back some adrenaline. It's such an exciting play. Oh. It's always a great reminder of baseball being such a team sport. This is only one. He's been swinging it really oh, well. They, had, they gave Otani the day off, too. Definitely a little out batter. in front of the pitch, but he didn't hook around it too much. Well, no, that's a strikeout, and that'll do it for the inning. One. Welcome back. We're in the seventh. We have a new pitcher on the mound, Walker Bueller. And we all know about his slider. It's just filthy, man. And one of the better ones in the game, I'd say. Spin rate's very high, and it just breaks a ton. And another ball. Double barreled action in the bullpen. Lake Trinan up and throwing. Garcia, a left hander, also throwing. Okay. And a pop up right side, foul territory. Freeman pulls that one down, and there's one down. Now up next for Arizona, Randall uh, Grichik. Grichik. Next nope, pitch is outside. outside. Base is empty, one away. Here at the top half of inning number seven. Can you come inside, maybe? No? Softly hit to third, and he picks it up in foul territory. One down, base is empty. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. Just early. Everything's slow all of a sudden. Kicks and fires. Way upstairs, and it's a full count. Out towards right center field. That one gets yes. down for a hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Two game for Grichik. Multi-hit game for him now, and with the lack of results he's been having lately, I'm sure he's feeling some relief. You know what they say, he couldn't have thrown it out there any better than that, and certainly the case that time. Just flared it back behind the second baseman and dropped it in there. Should have this one. Makes mm -hmm. the grab, and there's two gone. Mm-hmm. 
Francisco Mejia stands in now. He's at 194, which is actually better than I expected him to be adding. So that's good. Ball to strike. And that one clips the corner. Wow. Wow. Bounce to the right. Into the outfield base hit. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. So up next, Corbin Wow. Carroll. Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. This one lifted in the air, left field. Fair ball. Oh, why didn't you go home? Now, just a nice job coming through in a pretty high leverage spot right there. Just a blue pit behind third right there, and that's a really tough play for a third baseman or shortstop to get to. And the same for the left fielder. So he just found a perfect place to drop that one in right there. Now I don't the base know why is Big opportunity for them to break this game there. open. Righty delivers. Swing and a chopper. To first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. As a yeah. run scores. Boom, that's staying within his game right there. I mean, this speedster gets the wild. infield single, and now he's on base to possibly do some damage. I love seeing what guys like this can do to disrupt the game. Oh, right out of position to do so. He's got it, and that's the third out. So they get one, but end up. We're back in a new pitcher here to start the bottom of the seventh. Matt Barnes. Well, the best relievers love the opportunity to come in and protect the tight lead late in the ball game. Some of them are just wired different, so we'll see what he's got here. Man, those are the types of hits where you don't feel any vibration in your hands whatsoever. Such a good feeling. I really like that swing, man. He didn't just push it the other way through the infield. He drove it that way, and it kind of makes me think he was thinking opposite field as he stepped into the box. Got a pitch he liked, and he got it done. Could be extra bases. Lead runner touches second, heading for third. Safe, he beats it. Oh. Back-to-back base hits. Nice job keeping it fair as he turned on it down the line. And once it got through the infield, it was a double all the way. Now a pretty big at bat coming got? up with a chance to even this ball game up. I mean, and it was yes, a good pitch did. anyways. He went around. Why, are you, why are you squeezing my team, man? He goes down looking. A big strikeout right there, and maybe a little controversial with the call. I think he got a little bit of favor on the mound. No question about it. It's not exactly what you want to see. In the air to left center, Thomas sizes this one up. He's got it. Runner tags from third to the plate. Save! And it's a one-run game. Well, that's a quality at bat right there. You know the situation. You need something in the air and deep enough, and that's exactly what he did. Good pass to the baseball. So the tying run at second. Swings, fouls it off, and he breaks his back. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. And a base hit. Runner around third on his way to the plate. Save. Well, uh. see, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down, and it's like he's moving in full speed, and everybody is a step or two behind the way that he's... Well, he's under it to make the catch in center, and we'll take a break. Uh, getting man. started. Here's the cleanup hitter for the Diamondbacks, Jock Peterson. In the air, right side. On the move. Makes the grab, and there's one down. To the batter now, Geraldo Perdomo. I need to get someone else up. Let's get Thompson up, I guess. That one is absolutely belted. And that gets down into the gap. And he's into second base with one away as the go-ahead run. Always feels amazing getting a job done when the team needs you to come through. It's just bigger than your own individual stats. Got a good pitch to drive, stayed short with his bat path to the ball and caught it out front, and he stayed long in his follow-through. That's how you split the gap, and that's pretty much a double every time. A lot riding on this well, next bat now really? as they look to take the lead at a critical point in this one. Man, it's second. And that one off the outside edge. That's a really good take.
Here comes a 3-2. In the air on oh. the field. He's under it. Calls it in, two away. Yeah, I'm looking at his body language, and he just doesn't seem like things are in sync, and the ball's just not coming off his bat the way it did earlier in the regular season. Down the line. And that lands in no man's land, a foul ball. Man on second, two down. In the air, out towards right center. Center runner. Two. And that's the third out. Well, this guy. Back here in L.A., ready for the bottom of the eighth. And now, Freddie Freeman. Ready. Just off the inside edge. When you get to this part of the order, yeah, there's some pop there, but more likely there's some base hits. So very important to be patient. Let the pitcher walk you, if he will. Steps on first for the out. Now it's Mookie Betts. That play won't be trending on social media later on, but it's still important to execute it to perfection. This game is a lot harder than it looks, partner. Yeah, it is. Pitch misses there. And now three and two. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. Oh, Struck him out. Thanks and for swinging that, Mooks. Max Muncy at the dish. Next offering is in for a strike. That one missed. That's a good game. Two and two. On to first. They get the this out is on a one. good game. Could really go either and way. We're back. Here's the center fielder, Alec Thomas. The 1-1. One, one. Up the middle, Lux. On the run, throw to first. Oh. Now one gone in the ninth. Here's the catcher to hit, Francisco Mejia. If you want to be a great defense, you have to deliver consistently. It doesn't matter how many highlight reel plays you make if you can't execute the small stuff just like we saw. And it's caught for the out. I love Carroll to the top up of the lineup. Outs, and now the right fielder, Corbin Carroll. This is what to do. Makes the grab oh. and now in the inning. No runs, no that was hits, a double no error. Super easy. Six, seven, eight scheduled to start the bottom of the night. All tied up. Back here at Dodger Stadium. All set for the bottom of the ninth. Ryan Thompson will take over here. This guy's a strike thrower. He's done an excellent job of avoiding walks so far this season. And a count one and two. Yep. He doesn't have a guy. Oh, he does have a fastball. He fouls it off. We'll do it again. And a pitch. And a foul ball, he stays alive. At the belt, and fires. Ball Slider right misses right. outside. Still two and two after the foul oh. ball. I'm not going to ask for you to put it in play. Because if I do that, you'll hit a home and run. And a pitch. Oh. Foul ball, another 2-2 two -two upcoming. Quite the matchup we're seeing here. Six foul balls in this at bat alone. Really making him work out there. Ball four. He walked in. And that keeps things going. When you go after the umpire, the after the, the announcer was down. talking about how. And next for LA, Teoscar he hasn't walked Hernandez. anybody. Good ball. late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Your base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. And a pitch. Foul ball still a one and two count. The pitch. And a swing and a miss. There we go. And one out now. And now the center fielder, Jason Hayward. And there's no doubt that they'll feed off the energy from this crowd, right? I mean, yeah, I'd say the intensity level has gone up a few notches for sure.
On the ground, two ball. Over to Perdomo. That's one. Double play, and we're headed to extra innings. They made it look easy, but it started with a nice feed to the second baseman from the shortstop. Perfect. I thought that was the end of the eighth, not the end of the ninth. You're in but... extras here, and now the shortstop, Garrett Hampshire. All right, let's do this. Oh, starting Carroll on. I guess it wasn't so bad having him. Well, if he's going to do something special right here, it's going to have to happen with two strikes. On the... Man at second. Fouls it off, still one and two. Here comes a pitch. Now a fly ball to right center. Sizing this one up. Drops into the glove. Runner tagging for third. Okay, got this. And here's the first baseman, Christian Walker. The 1 1. In the dirt, blocked. Nice job behind the plate there. All right, we got this. We got this. Next pitch is downstairs. Definitely a strikeout situation right here. Lots of ways for that go-ahead run to score if the ball's put in play. Next pitch misses. Full count now. Jock Peterson waiting to hit for the D-backs. Swing and a ground ball out to short. Safe. He beats the tag. Four to three. They take the lead. You weren't going to throw Carroll out to there. To the mound now, they turn to Blake Trinan. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. And Jack Peterson stands in. Okay. Next hey. offering is in Ooh, for a nice strike. Nice pitch. Nice pitch, Trinan. Swing and he breaks his bat. And he That's the second time put it in his Jock has broke his bat in this game. The pitch. Line to left. Makes the Got catch. good contact on it, too. Not fooled at all right there. He was clearly all over it, but sometimes you hit it too hard and right at someone. You're looking for one of those loop hits to get a knock sometimes. Ground ball left side. Ugh. Third out, and that Ow. ends the frame. Gross. On to the bottom of the 10th. And yeah, at the plate for the Dodgers, Chris Taylor. Now on the mound for the Diamondbacks, Paul Seawald. I think closer has to be one of the toughest jobs in baseball, and we see a pretty high turnover rate because of it. Every outing seems to be high pressure, this one included. We'll see if he can wrap up the win and get himself a save. Okay. And ball okay. four to a board. And here is James Outman. Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted in first base with a quick free pass. Nobody out. Both the tying and winning runs on base. And we're in the last half of the 10th. Well, comfortable or not, these are the situations closers, they seem to live for. I mean, you get into some hot water, a jam, tough spot, whatever you want to call it, but this is where they earn their keep. Fights that one away, still one and two. So the tying run at second. That's a ball. And that's downstairs and outside. Rolled to short, possible two ball. Off balance feed, there's one. Got one. Two on, one out. Gavin Lux steps to the plate for the Dodgers. This to center field. Thomas sizes this one up, brings it in. Runner tags from third. The tag and that's Got him, goal. yes! Sometimes games come down to this. You've got to press the Oof. issue. Try to get that run across and tie it up. But an excellent throw. Nice job of concentration. Nice. The Good on the work, runner. everyone involved. Finish to this game today. And oh. Four here. Four three. A one run extra inning win for Chris. That was nice. Nice, 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 nice. 
Seawall shouldn't get the player of the game. No way. No way. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. I'll see you all next time. Bye.